Yeah, 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 yeah. Welcome back, bros. You know, being sick, being sick sucks. It's not fun. Um, but I think I'm, I'm pretty much on the verge of being better. Just gotta wake up, smell the apple cider vinegar, take a few capsules of ashwagandha, and breathe in that good ass prana. So we're back. You know what I've been doing more? I have this little notebook here. Um, this is an egg, as you can tell. I don't know how people get by their lives without eating eggs. I love eggs. I eat a lot of eggs. They've always served me well. So, in this little notebook, I've been writing, and one of the things we did the other day was write about our perfect dream girl. We want to you know, have a girl that is six foot three, well then, we write that down. Or if you want a girl with brown eyes, blue eyes, you write it down. And then eventually, your mind's attuned to that. You know, one thing I wish someone would have told me when I was a young lad is that it's important to realize that not everything you do, or just because you're doing a bunch of things, does not mean that you'll get a bunch of good consequences from those actions. And and that is really in the, if you condense that, or if you want to put a, a name to it, that's the Pareto efficiency rule, the law of Pareto. And that is your 80-20. Okay, so, you know, just to sum it up, 20% of the things we do are responsible for 80% of the outcome. Now that's huge because you know what I've been doing here? If I want to get better at something, I go right to here. And I write down, you know, if I want to be better with social skills, or if I want to be better, if I want to lose weight, I go right to here. And I think about what is the main thing that I can do? What is 20%? I don't need five different actions. No, if I want to lose weight, okay, ketogenic diet, high fat diet, and 15 minutes of cardio four times a week, 20%, boom. I don't got to worry about changing my rep scheme. I don't got to worry about anything else. I just got to figure out what's the main thing that's going to do that's going to be responsible for 80% of what I want to happen. So, if, so you know, I went down the list the other day and I was like, man, whatever you want to do or become good at, write it down and then become obsessed with getting better at that. Become obsessed, become relentless. And the thing about once you narrow it down to the, the most important 20%, then you can be diligent about continuing to do the things that actually matter. And that's what we're talking about here, is learning to do the things that actually matter and getting away from all the fruitless things. Because there's a lot of stuff you could be doing. And I, I know, I don't know about you guys, but I'm faced with um, a bunch of choices in life. Like I could be doing this. I could be doing that. But what's the most important? And this is actually what the one thing, the book, the one thing by Gary Keller and Jay Ad, um, Pasher is about. I highly recommend that you guys read this book. It's a phenomenal book. I seem to be stumbling with my notes. Um, yeah. So if you want to be more social, well, then you ask yourself, what, what would it take to be more social? Well, the most important thing is to get out there, to say hi to the random people. So you can be sharp with your social skills. If you want more women, well, then it's, you got to start talking to more women. You got to get more numbers, okay? So you don't, you don't just mindlessly go through life and hope that things work out. It's like you actually take action. If you want to become better at sales, well, then you read sales books more. You stop reading a bunch of other books and you read sales books and you get into sales and you practice sales. Maybe you get a mentor that helps you with that. If you want a better body, well, you follow a strong routine and you eat good food. I mean, that's right there is going to, you be consistent. You fought, you work out, you eat good food, boom, better body. It's like some things aren't as clear cut as that, but just look at what you want in life. Write it down, become relentless. Become relentless, stay true, stay consistent with doing the things that are going to give you that growth, all right? Don't let people sway you, tell you need, no, you know, like, you know pretty much what you need to do to get better, so 
stay consistent doing those things. Guys, I love you, bros. And I'll see you soon. Peace.